Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Grand Theft Auto 5 LSPDFR. Today we are going to be getting out on patrol with the Los Santos Police Department down here in Mission Row. We're going to be kind of staying around central Los Santos. As you guys can see, I have a new police uh, vehicle installed. I have a new fleet for my LSPD Dispatch stuff here. Um, we do have a gas nine. theft being Citizens reported report. here in La Mesa. We are going to go ahead and respond to that. Uh, 7 King 9, go and show me 1041 10 8. I'm going to be responding. Attach me to that call. So, yeah, guys, as I was saying, we do have another uh, uh, police pack installed, the new fleet for the LSPD. This one is by Toy, the same mod author who made uh, the pack that I was using before. So, he's got some really cool vehicles out there. If you guys want to check his stuff out, you can find him on lcpdfr.com. I'm also linking this pack down in the description as well and i'm using a different handling line on this car it was part of a pack that i tried out earlier but it wasn't working and i forgot to change it back and this one's a little more realistic so anyway 7 king 9 i'm going to be uh 1023. going to slip in here so it looks like there was a gas theft reported here it looks like here's the clerk he's right up here i'm going to be responding to him I'm going to go and figure out what's going on how's it going sir what can i do for you tonight Officer, officer, I've just been robbed. Okay, go, go ahead and explain what's happened. Some person just stole some gas from you. Okay. The vehicle was a black colored Feltzer 2. The license plate was 31 Lincoln Lincoln David 383. Dispatch, go and attach 31 Lincoln Lincoln David 383. That's going to be our suspect vehicle. It's going to be a black Feltzer. It took off in that direction. So. Okay, man. I'm going to go and see if I can find it. All right, we're going to be in search of a uh, black Feltzer. I have no idea what it looks like. <laughs> so it's going to be interesting to find this thing. We'll probably have to wait for an ALPR hit to come out for it. Uh, actually, that might be it there. We no, it's not it. All right, our ALPR has hit Manandre on it. Avenue. I'm going to go ahead and parallel it here. I love the lights on this car. They look absolutely amazing, especially at night. We have a traffic alert on a... Avenue. All right, looks like they're coming up here. I'm going to get in the right lane because I don't want to turn left, but they're going to be right on this road. Not sure where they're going to be. AOPR hit showed them coming up this way, so the wait and see for an update before I go after them. Go ahead and turn right here. That actually might be the car right there. We go and flip around on it. Yep, we have that's a it. Traffic alert on Center Street. They took it right here. Seven King Nine, be advised. I have eyes on that vehicle. This car is fast. Yeah, he's going real quick. He's driving like a maniac. A this is him right here. Ran a red light. 17 9 I'm going to be on traffic with that vehicle. Southbound Elgin Avenue. Oh, I almost hit him. <laughs> Southbound Elgin Avenue. Uh, it's actually just going to be in front of the 24-hour parking. Let me go ahead and kind of back up and get a good curve here. A little more. Perfect. Back up just, <laughs> just a little bit. We don't want to have people behind us freaking out. Um, let's go ahead and run the plate. 3-1 Lincoln Lincoln David. 3-8-3. Occupied times one. Let me go ahead and get an additional Seven, unit to come out here. Plate, three, additional local patrol. Three, three, I'm going to go and make contact while the uh, backup gets over here. Copy, dispatch. We'll How's it going, sir? I'm Officer Ice, the Los Santos Police Department. The reason why I pulled you over tonight is uh, a couple reasons, actually. The first is we received a report of somebody stealing some gas from a gas station out in La Mesa. And your vehicle was... Description was given to us by the clerk there. He gave with the plate and everything the exact description So that's why I stopped you second reason is just at this intersection here. You actually ran a red light So that's another reason why I stopped you. Um, do you have your ID on you yeah, registration proof insurance and all that stuff? Let's go ahead and see if we can question him about his gas stealing which we can't so um, Let me go ahead and bring up See if I can bring up the menu here. This guy doesn't know how to do it. let me get out of this guy's way Learn to go around me, dude. I'm gonna go and get this guy out of the vehicle. Go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, sir. Police! Stop whatever the hell you're doing! Go ahead and get out of the wow. range of Hold the up. 
default menu here. Go and follow me off to the side of the road, sir. I just want to question you here for a couple minutes. Just figure out what's going on here. That's good. All right, let's see if we can question him. We can't bring up any menus to question him. So we're just going to have to go with the... Uh, Stop the ped menu, which really doesn't help us because there's no questions pertaining to what we're doing. All right, man. So, uh, what are you doing tonight? It's two o'clock in the morning. You're out here stealing gas, from what I've been told. So, and they kicked me out of that menu. <laughs> um, where'd you come from? You have the right to remain silent. Okay, where are you headed to? Just going to the grocery store. All right. Well, like I said, the reason why I stopped you is because we got a report you were stealing gas. So, do you live around here? You live with your grandma? Alright, man. Um, just go ahead and sit tight for me. I'm gonna go ahead and run you through the system real quick. Officer, if you wanna go ahead and watch him, I'm gonna go ahead and run him through the system. Got the sexy Dodge Charger out here with us. I went all out with the, this fleet. I went into ELS and, and customized the, uh, the light bar patterns for all the vehicles, so. Anyway, we're gonna jump in here. Log in, pet database. Mr. Jack Gambino, he's valid no once. He's got no priors, which is surprising. Um, and his vehicle is not showing up in the vehicle database, which is fine. There's nothing on it anyway, so. All right, well, here's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to assume that the clerk had evidence this guy was stealing gas, so I'm going to be charging him with petty theft tonight at this point. I'll let him slide for the... Uh, for the running the red light, but he is going to be charged with petty theft. All right, sir, here's the deal. Um, we do have evidence that you stole gas. We got you on camera stealing it, and we have a clerk who's willing to press charges, so you're going to be charged tonight with petty theft. Um, it's hopefully not going to be that extensive a fine. I have to go in the system and check for it. I actually don't even know if we have a petty theft charge in there, but you're going to be charged with something related to that, and I'll make sure to walk it, walk through it with you before I... Uh, where you sign it so you know what you're signing. So go ahead and just sit tight for me for a second here, sir. I'm going to jump in the system here. I'm going to get his paperwork started. Someone's not happy. <laughs> Someone behind me was raging. It's something about a garbage truck. All right, so he's going to be charged with his coupe out here in Pillbox Hill. Let's see here, public. Um, let's see if there's like a theft charge or something like that. I don't know if there's going to be one. Misc arrestable misdemeanor. It's probably going to be in here if it's going to be anywhere. Uh, let me look here. Dog must be leashed. No. Um, those are all arrestable. I don't want arrestable. Wildlife isn't going to help me. A uniform traffic violations isn't going to help me because it's not a uniform traffic violation. Um, let's let's check non-moving. I I got to figure out what to charge this guy with. Blocking right of way, stopping, saying no. Uh, let me check. Uh... Oh man, misc moving violations. See if I can find something here to charge him with. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and just charge this guy with criminal mischief. Um, I'm assuming this is supposed to say petty larceny, but I don't think I can charge him with that. I don't think he's stolen enough goods to be qualified to be charged with larceny. So I'm going to charge him with criminal mischief. This says arrestable defense uh, here in the system, but I'm not going to arrest him. I'm going to use officer discretion. He's been cooperative. He stopped, but I'm going to charge him with criminal mischief tonight. And he is going to be charged with that. Like I said, officer discretion, I won't be arresting him, so. Alright, sir, here's the deal. I'm going to be charging you with criminal mischief tonight. There's nothing in our system that I can charge you for, like petty larceny or petty theft or anything like that. I'm going to have to go actually probably add that in or something. But I'm going to be charging you with criminal mischief. It is an arrestable offense. However, um, you are not going to be brought in tonight. It's at officer discretion. So here's the ticket. Go ahead and sign at the bottom. Sign an admission to guilt. Just a... Saying you'll get it taken care of. And other than that, man, I'm going to be cutting you loose. You can drive off in your car. Uh, do drive safe. You ran a red light. Pay attention to traffic violations. Other than that, man, I appreciate you being cooperative. And uh, you're good to go, man. Take off. Have a good night. Drive safe. All right. Off you go. 7 King 9. I got one uh, citation issued. 
I'm gonna be back 10 8. Make sure he drives off safe. He does. Horse is going to zip out. I'm going to go and get this officer uh, dismissed, and then I'm going to get back out on patrol. Whenever he wants to stop walking around. Come here, dude. I'm, try I'm trying to get you out of here. <laughs> well, somebody got busted. Somebody's getting pulled over. Is that even a cop? Uh, that's not even a cop. I don't think. Nope. Seven King Nine, be advised, I may have a possible stolen police vehicle. North Strawberry Ave, cross Vespucci. This is the, <laughs> I thought that was a cop. I was like, someone's getting pulled over. I got excited. Pull it over, dude. All right, here we go. Gonna request state patrol to come out here. Required on Strawberry Avenue. They're failing to yield this time, dispatch. They might actually be pulling over oh, here. Six, We're gonna be oh, Strawberry oh, Avenue Spucci still. I'm gonna go ahead and treat this as a felony stop here. Sir, get off the bike now with your hands up. Police, hands up now. Put your hands up, dude. Get on the ground. I got one at gunpoint dispatch. Be advised, they are complying. They're getting on the ground. I love how everyone over here is... <laughs> this idiot getting in my way. We got one at gunpoint dispatch. I'm going in for cuffs. You gonna cover me, man? But why did you tase him? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and cuff him. <laughs> okay, so this guy stole a police bike or something. I don't think this guy's a law enforcement officer. Alright, dispatch. We're seeing his code 4. Uh, dude, what are you doing? Why did you steal a police bike? Like, where did you even get this thing? There's no police station near here, as far as I'm concerned. What are you doing, man? You're <laughs> relaxing your soul. Where did you come from? From the hospital? Okay, are you high on drugs or something? No one in their sane mind would just steal a police bike. You're going to see a friend, but well, you're actually going to jail instead. Um, do you have a warrant around here? From another state, do you live anywhere around here? I'm just curious to know where you live, bro, okay? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pat him down real quick. I swear, if someone tries to steal my car, I'm gonna be really, really mad. Because my door is wide open. And I'm right next to it. This guy's got a receipt, a bottle of hand sanitizer, children's book, and some cocaine. He's got four grams of cocaine, so he's gonna be charged with possession of cocaine. He's gonna be charged with, uh, theft of a law enforcement vehicle this point <laughs> like I was I was excited I was like oh my gosh I'm actually witnessing an AI traffic stop happen and then I was like it took me about five seconds to realize that doesn't look like a cop and I was like hmm something's wrong here so I pulled out and sure enough this dude stole a police bike so anyway I'm gonna go ahead and get him in the back of my vehicle uh, I'm gonna go and give him a drug swab he does have some cocaine on him he could be high so I'm just going to swab him real quick. I don't know why my backup is all the way over there. I don't know why he's not here. He's got the Impala. Nice. Chevy Impala's out here. Uh, commit a crime and I will definitely give you a ride in my car. Okay. So, uh, he's negative. That's good. Uh, we already patted him down. He had cocaine. So I'm going to go ahead and just grab him. I'm going to put him in the back of my vehicle. I got to clear the road here. It looks like traffic is having a brain aneurysm right now. Yep. Put him in the rear seat of the vehicle. I'm going to go ahead and request a uh, vehicle to come pick up the uh, bike here. We have a 503 Close my door. I don't want my car being stolen. Desert. We're going to go ahead and have this thing towed out of here. I got seven of those. Uh, tow service. It's going to be for a large flatbed. Yeah, go ahead and take the vehicle. It's a cop car. I know what I'm doing. Flatbed. Assistance required on a... Uh, All right. Strawberry Avenue. Seven King Nine, go ahead and send a tow truck out here to pick up that police bike. Go ahead and show that state Appreciate unit that was out here uh, back 10-8. Citizens report a prohibited radio broadcast on a... Uh, this lady has been running across the road, like, back and forth. This homeless guy seems to be following her. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, Pull over right here. Roger, dispatch. We are at Up against the curb right in front of the newsstands or whatever these are. 
I'm going to jump in the system here. We're going to go ahead and get this guy's. I already got his ID. I got to look him up. We got Diego Caradima. He's valid no once. He's been charged with a DOT violation for not having a helmet as a passenger, I guess. And he's also been charged with a uh, DWI first offense under 21. So that's nice. <laughs> he's, he's got a, he already has a DWI under his belt. So he's going to be arrested tonight for stealing a, a law enforcement vehicle. Let's see if we can find something that something of that nature. We've got uh, possession of um, stolen property, possession of stolen vehicle, first and foremost. And other than that, he had the cocaine on him. So we got to go over to drugs, legal substances. He had cocaine. Unfortunately, cocaine is not on here. It was schedule one. Schedule two. There we go. Okay. So we've got possession of cocaine. It's a schedule two narcotic, apparently. So that's awesome. It's, it's not just under drugs. Now it's under schedules. That's cool. I love this new uh, computer plus script thing that I installed, the uh, charges and citations. It's a lot more realistic. Anyway, I'm going to go and charge him with possession of a stolen vehicle and possession of a cocaine. And I'm going to go and request a prisoner transport to come pick this guy up, and then I'm going to get back out on patrol. Attention Dispatch, can I get a uh, on, um, transport out to Strawberry, Strawberry Avenue. for uh, this retard over here? <laughs> I still don't know how he managed to uh, steal a police car. Or a police bike in front of us. <laughs> we too. We are on our way. She is gonna be soliciting, so I'm gonna go ahead and. Yeah, you're attempting to. <laughs> I'm a police officer for crying out loud. All right, well we're gonna be out here with this uh, possible prostitute. Seven King Nine, go and show me westbound or now southbound Little Bighorn Aves crossing Andreas with a potential prostitute. I'm going to go ahead and uh, make contact with her. Ma'am. Wow. Hold up. You do realize that what you're doing is illegal? You're soliciting out here tonight. Um, that's not legal to do. You're kind of out in the open, too. You have a homeless cam right behind you. I mean, you could freaking, for all we know, be murdered. And we'd never hear from you. So, do you happen to have an ID on you? Get up. She does. Thanks. We got Tina Venito over here. I'm gonna go ahead and get her uh, checked out. Dispatch, can I get 2729 on Tina Venito? We have another prostitute right there. Her solicitor, I should say. She's not a prostitute yet, but that guy's got some nice underglow. All right, so we got uh, Tina Venito. She's clear. She's got nothing wrong with her. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and issue her a warning. I'm gonna get you a warning tonight. You haven't done anything illegal as far as I know. Uh, but if I flip through here again later on and you're still here, I'm going to be taking you in for solicitation, prostitution, and all that. And that chick over there is sweet-talking that cop, too. So, uh, get out of here, ma'am. Don't do this again. All right. Off you go, go get a real job. Do something. I don't Attention know. Attention all units. Citizens report suspicious activity and Pillbox Hill. Units respond code 2. Oh my gosh. Alright, here's how you get rid of uh here's how you get rid of prostitutes. Yep. <laughs> they take off running. Yep, that's how you get rid of prostitutes, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, seven king nine going straight back to an eight. A robbery with a firearm. All available units respond code three. Dude, you just ran that red. Well, I was going to hate that call out for a second there, but I decided to switch over to this guy. We have plenty of other officers on this handling. We have plenty of other officers uh, who can deal with it. I'm going to be pulling this guy over. I almost tapped that guy in the back. 7 King 9 traffic. Northbound Interstate 2. It's actually we're on Las Lagunas. Northbound Las Lagunas. Cross, or actually just above Interstate 2 at this time. I'm going to be out with a... Uh, Yellow, orange, color-ish, uh, Feltzer, occupied times one. License plate is going to be 00 X-Ray Queen Union 080. It's a lot of zeros. Target license No additional plate. units. 00 X-Ray Queen Union 080. No 1099. 
How's it going, sir? I'm Officer Ice with the Los Santos Police Department. The reason why I'm stopping you tonight is because you failed to yield at the red light back there, turning it on to Las Lagunas here. So that's why I'm stopping you. Uh, do you have your ID on you tonight? Registration proof of insurance. Wrong option. <laughs> do you have your ID and registration proof of insurance and all that stuff? Mr. Steve Carter. You look very nice tonight, Mr. Carter. You got a suit on. You got a really nice car. You probably work in a really good industry here in Los Santos. Anyway, man, just go and sit tight for me. I'll be right back with you. I'm just going to go ahead and run his information through with the system. Got valid. He's got no wants or warrants. He has been arrested on the past for participating in a riot. Apparently, it was a felony charge. And he's been charged with citation wise with motorcycle riding no more than two abreast. Um, I don't know what that means. Maybe he's been riding with more than two people, I guess. Expired driver's license and duty to yield to highway workers. So he failed to yield to highway workers. All right, well. Um, his Felser 2 is valid, no one. So I'm going to go ahead and just give him a simple citation for his uh, failure to yield to a traffic control device or signal or whatever. Failure to stop for a uh, traffic signal. And the citation is missing required information. Good gosh. Just put it in automatically for me. Simple citation, getting back out on the road here. Alrighty, sir, so I'm going to be issuing you a citation tonight for failure to stop at a traffic signal. Uh, you clearly did not stop at that red, you just went right through it. Even though it was a right turn, you still have to stop before you go, so. $260 citation, go and sign at the bottom. It's not an admission of guilt, it's just saying you'll get it taken care of. If you have any questions, feel free to contact the Los Santos Police Department. And as soon as it's safe to do so, I want to back up a vehicle. You can pull out, just drive safe. There is a pedestrian here who doesn't know what he's doing, so... Just be careful around him. Other than that, man, drive safe. Have a good one. Alrighty, 7 King 9. Go and show me back. 10 8. Got a citation issued. Alright, so I hit another one of those invisible barrier things in the middle of the road. I'm trying to repair my car. There we go. Fortunately, I only took out one of my headlights, but I wasn't going very fast, so it wasn't a catastrophic damage thing but it's still annoying to hit those so unit seven, um, we're getting we a call out a for, for a, grand theft. a grand theft they are wanted for organizing shoplifting okay so we got some organized shoplifters seven king nine going to attach me to that i'm gonna go ahead and attempt to respond to that but that guy was just on a traffic stop the guy took off pretty quick So yeah, we're going to be attempting to make contact with our ALPR hit. Um, as soon as we get closer to them, uh, we will shut off our uh, our lights. We'll go dark, I guess, without actually shutting the lights off. I'm going to go ahead and immediately just cut to the left lane here. Looks like they're already off the highway, so we are going to have to get off right here. If Is there an exit here? No, I thought there was an exit. Oh well, we'll just keep going. We'll follow the GPS. GPS knows the best. But we are going to uh, stop these guys. They have a warrant for their arrest. Shoplifting. Organized shoplifting, I should say. And I hit the wall because I'm not paying attention. <laughs> Distracted driving. <laughs> it exists in GTA as well. I don't know where to go. The highway's not divided here. Okay, so. Yeah, they're, they're sure. Apparently still on the freeway here. We're going to be flying at almost 100 miles an hour to catch up to them. And they're still somehow a mile and a half, or not a mile and a half, a half a mile ahead of us. They must be going pretty quick. They are going fast. Rocking it at 100 and almost 120 miles an hour now. We're catching up to them. They must be going fast. I should have my siren on technically, but I'm in the left lane. There's no one here. Oh, oh, head on collision. I'm out of that. There's no way I'm getting out of that. We're going to RP that. We just had a head on collision. 
Our push bar force absorbed all of it. We're gonna... 7 King 9, go and remove me off that call. Of course, it's gonna bug out and I'm gonna get... wanted. There's no way I'm gonna be able to continue to respond to that call out, so... I'm gonna have to remove myself off of that. Oh, that's embarrassing. Well... I'm gonna have to get myself towed out to, uh... the station get a new vehicle, so... let me go ahead and get that started. All right, we got us a new vehicle. Dispatch calling unit Hot pursuit of a military we have tank. A possible 148. All right, we're back in another Lamenta. pursuit. Seven King Nine, go and attach me. Just got out of the garage as soon as you, as soon as that call came in. Pursuit of a military tank. Well, this will be interesting. We are a car. We can't really do anything revolving pit maneuvers. I hate how they take control of the camera like that. I can't see what I'm doing. Looks like we have a couple other units out with us. Dispatch on third in the pursuit. Wait, a tank? Oh, what did I get myself into? I thought this was a tanker. He's giving up. Dispatch, we got one at gunpoint. We got two at gunpoint. You moron. Holy cow. Get on the ground, dude. Police! Dispatch, we have two at gunpoint. I thought this was a tanker. Little shit. I was like, oh, this will be easy, but holy cow, a tank. An actual you tank. Yeah, man, I don't believe my eyes either, but I'm not lying. You're under arrest. All right, apparently we have three suspects apprehended. I don't know where the third Attention. one is. This is dispatch. No further units required. Holy cow, what in the absolute heck? How did you guys steal this thing? What? I'm at a complete loss as to how they stole this. Dispatch, can you contact Zancudo Military Base and ask them if they have a stolen tank? If they're missing any tanks. <laughs> okay, um, I'm just gonna call prisoner transport and get these guys backed up. I gotta figure out how to get, uh... Assistance required on, um... I gotta figure out how to get this tank out of here. These guys are being charged. I'm going to leave this up to Zancudo to figure out what they want to charge him with. Because this is a military tank. This is out of my jurisdiction. I can't charge him for this. I, I was thinking this was a, like a tank or, you know, like a gas truck. You know, you go to this gas station, you see a gas truck there putting gas in. I didn't realize this was an actual tank. I need to read the call out description a little bit more. All right, how are we going to get this thing out of here? This thing's going to have to be towed out of here on a large flatbed. If a large flatbed can... All units. Wait, hang on a second. On, I want to make um, sure this is actually towing the tank, oh, right, not my okay, car. Reports of alien spotted. Possible hope. Let's go ahead and attach me to that dispatch. I'm going to go and get this thing out of here. An asterope. Well, I can't tow this thing. <laughs> it's not going to let me. Low priority respond code 2. All right, so it's uh, low priority. 7 King 9, go ahead and start something to tow this freaking tank out of here to Supply Street, just near Interstate 4. Go ahead and also show me your sign to the possible hoax with an alien. That was insane. I was under... I was under the impression that was just going to be a tanker. I was like, oh, we're just going to pursue the guy. He's going to lose control. Might possibly blow up. This is a low-priority call. My suspension is going crazy. It's actually not even my suspension. It's the handling line on this car. It's very realistic. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and turn right here. That must have been a stolen car behind me. I don't know where we are. There was a, uh, a shootout here at this gas station a while back. An LSPD officer was involved in a shooting. That was uh, crazy. What? Seven King Nine, I have eyes. Uh, go ahead and start me back up. Code three. Assistance needed on um, a ranch of What? The heck just happened? I had three aliens running at me, and they're gone. Attention, Unit Seven King what? Nine. I'm we confused. We have a robbery in Mirror Park. Okay, well, Seven King Nine. Uh, there's nothing here apparently. I'm just gonna do a quick little walkthrough. I'm gonna clear the road real quick. I'm gonna get these guys out of here. Appreciate you guys coming out, but I don't know what the heck's going on. Appreciate it. 
You guys are good to go and get out of here. I don't know if this guy's gonna actually leave. Um, yeah. I... Dispatch calling unit 7 King 9. We I don't feel like this a is just a prank a knife on a by the plug-in developer. <laughs> Appreciate you coming out, but Thanks. there's nothing here. I am, however, just gonna do a quick little walkthrough. There was a vehicle and three aliens. They just come running at you and you're like, crap, what do I do? Go out and start shooting at them? Anyway. It's like 3 o'clock in the morning here in Los Santos. I'm probably hallucinating. I'm going to get off patrol. Well, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment. Consider subscribing to my channel. Okay, people. Thank you, sir, for being nice and letting me get in my car. I'm loving this new LSPD pack I threw in my game. The lighting looks great. The environmental lighting looks good. Like, you can see the blue lighting up the building behind me just oh it looks so good haven't really done a lot of night patrols lately because nighttime it's harder for people to see it's darker out i know that jeff faviano had a a custom visual file for his nighttime that made it lighter i don't know much about visual file editing so i'd love to do something similar to that but then again i don't really do a lot of night patrols so anyway guys again thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next lspdfr take care 7 King 9, 1042, 107.